Hey everyone, welcome to a new series here on the channel. It is going to be Civilization 6, a super fun game. I personally love it and really enjoy it, and I hope you guys will too over this series. It's going to be super fun. We're going to be playing as Americans on the world map. It's going to be really good. We're going to have a fun time. We're going to do things that Americans did in the past, except now that I say that, probably not, because some of the stuff they did was not so great. But regardless, either way, it's going to be super fun. I hope you guys enjoy this series. Let me know if you want more. Even if you don't, I'll probably still record more anyway because I already have the footage. All right, starting off. So for our first city, what's it going to be? All throughout this entire series, guys, I want the names to be very American. So if other people come, come into our territory and they're like, hey, what's up? They're going to they're gonna know it's us, right? So we got to have a name to fit that. So throw a long... Uh, thought-filled, complicated process, I came up with our first city name. Taco. That's right. Taco, and just like that, an empire is born. The whole entire world will soon be ruled by this empire, and it all starts with Taco. Next, we gotta figure out what part of the world we're on. And to do that, we need to explore. So through some heavy, intense exploration, we found out that we were on Africa. And after a while longer, boom, we found Mount Kilimanjaro, which if you didn't know, was in Africa, so that confirmed our suspicion that we're on the African continent. See, you learned something here today, folks. It's basically the Discovery Channel. Keep running until you cannot. Uh oh, what's that? And then, before you know it, folks, we run into our first other people the man, the myth, the legend who really needs a Gillette sponsor, the Norwegians. And then not soon after, they start yelling at us for not having unprotected seas. Like, uh, dude, we're called Taco. We're landlocked in Africa. You don't have, you, your seas are unprotected too. So not starting off the relationship good with Norway. And then we finally have our first fight outside of Taco. Which, of course, because we're America, we win. As you can see, we clearly beat the senses out of our opponents with our giant clubs. And then right before we're trying to get our new land settled, the classical era version of a Gumby appears before us and calls us himself Caesar. Dude, I don't eat sa- And then I really didn't want what this man was selling, so I promptly told him to get out of my face because I have bigger things that I need to do. And then, boom, our second city is born. And again, with our complicated thinking process, we name the second city. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Lasagna. And then, guess who appears again? Our favorite unsponsored friend who yells at us for genuinely no apparent reason. And at this point, I'm getting, I'm getting a little anxious. I really, I don't really like this guy. He talks a lot and he doesn't do a lot. So I'm. I kind of have the idea in the back of my mind. Maybe we don't want to share a continent with this fella. And then to pass the time between getting yelled at by different uh, rivaling empires, we do what we do best. And that's beat up people who probably don't have the resources needed to defend themselves. And with our newfound power trip, we decided to establish a third city with our ever-growing, powerful American empire. Shall be known as pizza. And through another uneventful 20 minutes that thankfully I can cut out due to the power of editing, we get our fourth city splitting that difference between taco and lasagna. So I'm running out of American things at this point, so I'm starting to do like uh, American ideas. And that leads to the creation of. The first menu item from a restaurant, the Wendy's 4 for 4. And then somebody found they were into tacos, so we kind of had to make an example out of them. 
And then we find our second wonder of the world, Signe, which if you didn't know for your Discovery Channel fact number two, is located in Madagascar. And then later on we find this new fella, and then she's like, hey, you're pretty cool, I'll give you some gold. And it's like, hey, that's pretty rad. I'm pretty sure she just didn't want to get wiped off the map by a Wendy's 4 for 4, but that could just be me. And apparently, because one beating was enough, somebody found their way into Taco's borders again, which then prompted them to get sniped by Taco. And because getting thrashed two times in one episode was enough, the barbarians then again reinvade an American territory, this time it being Pizza, where Pizza simply and easily deletes them off the face of the earth. And then after a tiny skirmish and about an hour of the barbarians being as annoying as that fly that just lives in your room for a couple days and then somehow disappears, we finally wipe the barbarians off the map. So there's less flies in our room, even though how do they get there in the first place? Where do they come from? Why are there so many and why are they so loud? And just... continuing our quest for world domination, we name our fifth city. And this one is going to be named after another Wendy's menu item. And not just any Wendy's menu item, the best Wendy's menu item, and that's a fact, that's not debatable. Remember that poorly groomed man that kept annoying us and only asked for no apparent reason? Yeah, so apparently he declared war on us, which you know, I was about 10 turns away from doing that anyway, because he was getting really annoying, so he just kind of saved me like the favor and the blame, so that's good. And, um... Not only one person declared war, but this other person that I don't care about and forgot existed did too. So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to fight through this. And this is where I'm gonna end the episode off. Is right when the Norwegians declared war on us. That will all be happening in the next episode. So make sure to tune in for that one. It's gonna be really exciting. I've already recorded the f footage. It's really fun. You guys are gonna love it. But I want to make sure that you guys are enjoying this series and if you think there's anything I can do better personally whether that's editing or like uh, the commentating or maybe like less or more of that would you like to see more gameplay footage I kinda left out the parts where I built up my army and my city and it's more the technical stuff that I personally wouldn't want to watch if I was to watch a civilization esque video this is kinda what I what I'd personally like to watch but if you guys want something changed or think I can improve in any way please leave a comment down below and if you really like it and you're looking forward to the next um, episode and the continuation of this series, please leave a like and a subscribe. I appreciate everyone who does so. It means a lot, and I cannot wait to see where the series goes. And I'll catch you all on the next episode.